this the place you're a regular? Yep. It's just you. Yeah, such great customer service, huh? No wonder this place. I only run it for fun. Kind of prefer it empty, in fact. <laughs> Bullshit. Hey there, Dachi san. Hey, Iroha chan. Who are your friends? Some guests of mine. Hey. You never bring anyone with you. In fact, is. Uh, <laughs> I guess it is. Now that must mean you actually like them, huh? <laughs> Hell no. You wouldn't catch me in. <laughs> you're so cute when you're embarrassed. Uh, <laughs> give me a Hang on. Let me guess. You want me to add their drinks on your tab. <laughs> oh, you know me. Uh, you mind, though? I promise I'll make them come back as pain. Oh, good grief. You really an ex-cop? <sighs> you win this time. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right, let's get to drinking. Hey, what's up with Namba? We barely get started and he passes out? He's probably just tired. Can't bl- Tomorrow's only gonna be worse. But you know, for some reason, being around you makes it feel like- Oh yeah? You must be pretty wasted if you're handing- <laughs> Ha! I'm barely even feeling a buzz. Oh, he's drunk all right. Drunk on the rush of a hot and steamy friendship. <laughs> Iroha-chan. That was two feet over the line, and you know it. Don't poke an old bear, Mm -hmm. Listen. Yo, Adachi-san. What's that you're drinking? <laughs> hey, keep it down, will you? Why? Oh, is that convenience store Shh, you don't have to announce it to everyone and their mother. You brought your own drink to a... Hell yeah! It cost an arm and a leg to get a good bus going here. That's why I got this little lovely at a store down the street. <laughs> you ought to do the same. Show your wallet some tender love and care. Sure, I don't mind bringing my own booze, but I wouldn't be hiding it. But then the bartender might find you out. Eh, I'd take the risk. I don't want to bother with trying to hide a drink while I'm having fun. Wish I could be so carefree. <laughs> well, now I have to buy you a drink, pal. That's what carefree... Hey, thanks. Speaking of money, what they did to you was fucked up, man. Discharge right- Ah, it ain't so bad. At least I get to know I was canned for sticking it to fucking Horonouchi. My opinion? That's better than just staying on the force, turning a blind eye. Let me see if I remember this correctly. You and Horinouchi first crossed paths during a case 20 years ago. Yeah, it was a nasty one. Robbery, a double homicide of some sweet old couple. My team found a suspect and made an arrest. Man by the name, he had a mile-long rap sheet. Burglaries and shit. Plus, he had no alibi for the time of the- In the end, he was in- Yeah. I finally figured that out from his son. His son? Kasumi had a wife and kid. Kid was five years old. His name was Takashi. The little guy told us he'd been on a walk with his dad at the time the homicide- Of course, there's always a chance that the relatives will lie in the hope of saving- So, HQ was prepared to ignore Takashi's- I was too, at first. 
But the more time that passed, my thoughts and even after Kasumi was arrested. I finally found the owner of a cigarette shop. Told me he saw Kasumi walking with Takashi. Takashi's testimony was legit all along. I contacted HQ right away and requested Kasumi's release. But Horu no Uchi made sure it never happened. And he was... Yeah. And don't forget, he'd just been offered a job with the Tokyo police, so... He, he shipped poor Kasumi off to prison, knowing full well the man was innocent. Next thing I know... So Horu no Uchi was willing to sacrifice people's lives just to... Yeah, I'm starting to understand why you got so much beef with him. I... Uh, if only I'd believed Takashi's testimony from the start, the arrest wouldn't have happened. You don't know that for sure. No one else believed... Yeah, but I'm the one who interviewed the kid. Let me tell you, even after all this time... Man... But couldn't you have just leaked the fact that... I gotta assume that'd be your way of atoning for... <laughs> well, you're not as dumb as you look, Kasuga. That's exactly what I thought at the time. But I screwed it up. Didn't choose the right people to leak to, so... I got swept off to the license center faster than the leak got swept under the... Don't be so hard on yourself, Adachi. Sorry. Really killed the mood, didn't I? <laughs> it's okay. A true friend doesn't care how many moods you kill. <laughs> you know, for an ex-Yakuza, you can say some cheesy shit. What do you mean by that? Yakuza's all about brotherhood. Well, all I know is if I'd had a brother like you on the force with me, my life might have... Ah, but if the cops were anything like me, this whole country would be fucked. <laughs> Can't argue with that. <laughs> you weren't supposed to agree with that. <laughs> anyway... Let's have another drink. On you, if you don't mind. Fine. Hey, bartender, can we... Well... Aww. Leaving already? Oh, sorry, Iroha-chan. Yo, Namba. You gonna crash on the bar, or you wanna head back? <laughs> I like the vibe of this place, though. Me coming back- Sure. Make yourself at home. <laughs> Nobody else does. And listen. Take care of him. Sorry? Let's just say he's not usually a happy drunk. <laughs> I guess that means he has a son- Oh. Oh yeah, I know the guy. He's a good for nothing, but he's good at heart. So keep your friends close, you- I can do that. Hey, Kasuga! What's the holdup? Oh, sorry! <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Bento got thrown out with half the food left in it. What a waste. Yeah, I wouldn't eat that. The leftovers oh. like those are dangerous. The bacterium. Multiply faster. Oh, I won't. I'm guessing you've made that mistake before. <laughs> no way. I got more pride than that. I don't do bacteria. <laughs> oh, yeah? So what if someone tossed out an unopened Bento? Yeah, well, that would be... <laughs> Bring it on. Okay. I got this. Have fun with this. Take your best shot. Take those. Yeah. Come on. Let's go. Take those. Let's go. Hot, 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 
Let's go. Come on. Go in it. Come on! 